Hi, I'm Eric. Hi, I'm Celia. Welcome back to Seed VK Show. Um, what do we have today? First thing is the Y terminal based dock. A lot of customers have asked us to manufacture one like this. Just like those docks for smartphones? Yeah, and it works the same way, just like the docks for iPhone or your Android phone. You just plug your wild terminal onto the Type C sock. Okay, then you don't have to worry about power supply. The purpose of this dock is to connect your wild terminal with your PC. So you can just debug or flash your program into wild terminal, do anything, just consider it as a cable. Cool, what's next? Next thing is the 5 inch display for Raspberry Pi, which supports 5 finger capacitive touch. That's great, um, but will this be costing? I remember the 7 inch ones for Raspberry Pi sells at around $70. Yes, that, that's quite expensive, but we offered this 5 inch one at half the price. That's amazing, then uh, how does it perform? Let's just check it out. Okay, let me show you how to assemble the screen. Firstly, connect it with the Raspberry Pi using this cable. Okay, this is connected. Now let's power the Raspberry Pi on. Okay, it's on. Now let's give it a little try. Do you want to touch? Don't you want to touch it? Yes. The touch screen. Okay. Yeah. Now let's click the menu. Okay, everything looks fine. Now let's try keyboard and mouse. Let's just open. You can see the the point. The pointer is responding quite smoothly. Now let's open the terminal. Try a simple command icon. Hello. Okay, it works just fine. This is amazing. Just one cable to power and send data. Yes, absolutely. Just plug and use. No extra config configuration needed. This is just the best screen for Raspberry Pi. That's great. And now we have a bunch of cameras for Raspberry Pi and just Nano. They are about wide angles or narrow angles or some camera modules for Raspberry Pi. We are not, we're not going to test them one by one, but we're going to test some, a few for just nano as a lot of people are using just nano for CV projects. So a good camera is really important for them. So let's do a little test for them. The first camera I'm going to test is the 130 degree camera. The sensor you use is MX219, so it's perfect compatible with just nano. Now let's try, let's see the performance. Okay. It's so clear. It's quite a, it's quite wide, right? The angle. Okay. Now let's test the next one. The next camera I'm going to test is the uh, 160 degree camera. It's also the same sensor, MX219. As you can see, the quality is just as a normal MX219 sensor, but the angle is much wider. This one is about 160 degree. Now let's try a camera with normal angle. This one is 77 degree. And the sensor is the same as the, the former two. It's also MX219. Whoa. So the quality of this one is much better than the former two, yes. but with much narrow angle. But I think this is a, a good one if you are going to do like CV project. Okay, the last one is the most amazing one. The camera module with 200 degrees. Let's try. Let's see how this look. <laughs> so basically it includes everything in front of it. 
I think this is the most suitable camera for civilian's purpose. Also, you can screw the lens to control focus. Awesome. Yes. As many are requiring us to keep manufacturing the recomputer case, but due to some uh, issues, we cannot deliver them on time. So we provide you with a design of acrylic case. You can just download the design file and cut acrylic by yourself, then assemble it. The outcome, the product, when you assemble the product, it should look like this. This is for you to put a 2.5 inch hard disk. And this one is for you to put a 3.5 inch hard disk. Mm, do this case sells on website? Yeah, it's also we also provided on our official website. You can buy it from us if you don't want to cut acrylic by yourself. We hold a comment to win contest last week, and whoever left a comment can join this contest to win the Wild Terminal and 16-bit AD converter for free. I'm using this wild terminal to do the lucky draw. Now let's see who's the lucky guy today. Let's start. I'm not going to look at it, so I'm not sure who's going to win. Okay, stop. Okay, congratulations, Prima. We will contact you later, so please provide us with your contact information. So we will send you a wild terminal and an AD converter. And this is everything we have today. Thanks for watching the City Weekly Show. See you next week. Bye-bye.